Hey guys, I just want to share with you something really cool today. This is Bitter. He is a four-legged robot inspired by Boston Dynamics Spot. In a way, this is a miniature version of the Spot. He can run, walk, crawl, say hello, do push-ups, and <laughs> yeah, awesome, right? You can build it, customize it, and add additional components and actions using various platforms like Petoy mobile phone app, Arduino, Python, and so much more. Yes, guys, it's designed to work with everything. And the best part is he is affordable. Let's take a deeper look into it. This is the box that it came in. Here, you can see all the parts along with the tools to assemble everything. That means, in order to get started and have fun with your robot pet, you don't need anything more than a mobile phone or a laptop. You can start assembling as soon as you get the package. It's also worth mentioning that all the parts are very well designed and you won't have to apply too much force while assembling the parts. If you arrange it properly and use all the parts, you should be able to neatly arrange everything with very less wires and internal circuitries exposed outside. The battery is also included with the package and can be recharged using a 5 volt 1 ampere DC adapter. The position of the battery can be shifted in order to adjust the center of gravity of the robot when we are connecting additional modules. Oh, I forgot to tell you that. In addition to the inbuilt sensors, we can add additional sensor modules to this robot pup and give him additional sensors. This includes camera modules, ultrasonic sensor and a lot of other sensors and do fun things like object tracking easily. You can even connect a Raspberry Pi to it. Once you finish assembling your robot pup, you can do the initial calibration using your computer. The downloaded chip with which we can connect the board to the computer is also included with this kit. Simply connect it to your computer, fire up Arduino IDE, upload the OpenCAD sketch and you are good to go. You can also make fine adjustment to this position of the motors programmatically using Arduino Serial Monitor. The initial configuration of the coding environment is really easy and fun but if you are not sure how to do it, don't worry guys, we will be covering everything in the next step by step setup tutorial video. Now, after everything is set up, there are multiple ways for controlling the robot. Now, did you see this thing right here? This is an infrared receiver. Using this remote controller that comes with this package, we can control the robot and do so many actions. You can also communicate with your robot pup wirelessly via Bluetooth. The package includes a Bluetooth module which can be connected to the main control board, with which you can communicate with the robot pup easily. We can simply download the app on your phone, pair it with the Bluetooth module and control them. You can even calibrate the board using the application. If you are familiar with Arduino, Python and know how serial communication work, we can easily control the robot pup by sending serial commands to it. We'll be covering that as well in the next video. It's so cool, right? But we are just getting started. As I mentioned earlier, we can program this at different levels using different programming languages and softwares. If you are a beginner, you could use softwares like Ptoy Desktop App or Tinkerden Codecraft to play with it. If you know Arduino or Python programming, you could start working on the Beetle robot using Arduino IDE, Python and Raspberry Pi as well. And if you are an expert in coding or if you are doing some research, you could work on various machine learning platforms to create algorithms for motion planning. This board is now available in different configuration, colors, along with different sensor modules which can be attached to Beetle. You can purchase from different platforms, so if you want one, I will share the link in the description. Also, our viewers will get additional discount if purchased from the link below. So, make sure you check it out. We can do a lot of things with it. The next question might be, how? We will see. In the next video, we will be showing you how we will program and control our robot pup using Arduino IDE.